All right, hey there, guys. Adrian Castle here, aka Jedi Bro ninety five, coming at you guys with another video. And in this video is going to be my weekly recap of all the content in Madden NFL twenty one. Uh, this will be the second video uploading uh, today. So uh, if you guys did not get the first one, which is my, um, or if I do upload the first one, uh, if you guys did not see the first video, if it is uploaded, uh, check it out. It is the second most recent video on my channel. It's basically talking about who I think will win the midseason NBA awards. Uh, but for this video, guys, I'll just recap all of the content that has come out uh, in Madden NFL 21. Uh, so ending off with the all rookie promo, I think I did include this in the last video, but if I did not, um, this, uh, night train lane is the final card to come into, uh, Madden 21. I'll just showcase his numbers right there. There he is. Cool. Okay. Anyways, so moving on, uh, the next card that I wanted to showcase and uh, the next series of cards actually was, is power up cards. Now these power ups were for the campus heroes in, um, that are already in the game and i made a special video about this on when on tuesday e evening uh basically going what the fuck is this basically and i actually got age restricted for that which can i say youtube fuck you for that um but at the same time though it is what it is they're doing their job so i'm i'm can only be upset about the fact that they did it not the fact i can only be upset at the fact that i fucked up but anyways um so I made a video and I still stand by it with the power up cards. These make absolutely no sense as to why they implemented the power ups for the campus heroes, especially when you consider the fact that you can already change the camp, the team cams on the campus heroes, which is literally the point of a power up. So again, like I said in that video, part of me has to believe, and I even said it on Twitter, part of me has to believe that there is going to be ultimate legends for these cards part of me has to believe that there's going to or even an upgrade later on in the future because like i said in the video i don't see myself i don't see tim tebow getting the fucking upgrade there's just no way but or an ultimate legends card he might get like another upgrade later on like maybe like a combine pro not combine maybe like a college draft promo or like a draft promo or something um but even then this doesn't make any sense as to why they would up like uh release these and Nope, and not come anything for him. So, like I said, part of me has to think that these cards are getting a, uh, upgrades later on down the road. Uh, moving on to the next part uh, was the Thursday Limiteds. Now, the Thursday Limiteds were Keanu Neal and they were Trent Brown for um, the um, Raiders. And I think Keanu Neal is the Falcons. Yes, he is. So, Falcons players uh, got Keanu Neal. This is his stats real quick. Just showcase him. Uh, don't want to spend too much time on it because he's been out for a couple of days, but it's a good safety. Um, you know, it's a really good card. Um, yeah, this is just a really good card. Nothing really else to explain. Uh, and then, uh, Trent Brown, I actually did pick up his power up now and I actually haven't powered up all the way till, uh, 95 overall. I just need to get this card now, uh, to, um, finish upgrading him. Uh, but this card is really good. Um, yeah, no, no complaints about this card. This card looks really nice. Um, hopefully he's not as bad of an edge protector as, uh, uh what the fudge is his name? Uh, Mitchell Schwartz, uh, because his strength is a little bit on the lower side, but Hey, you know, he's still got the, he's still got great stats, you know, all around great stats. Um, moving on to the next one. This one came out yesterday. Um, or which was the I didn't mean to click on it, which was the the um, Mutt Heroes, uh, brand new cars come out last night or yesterday. I mean, um, yeah, Mutt Heroes, forty four players, twenty one masters, and one LTD. Uh, so Darnell Mooney was one of the cars that was revealed. Uh, I'll just move this over down like this real quick. There we go. Honestly, this is a solid card. Um, uh, you know, this on a theme on Bear Steam team. Power uh, on a bear steam team. This will have 99, uh, 98 speed. Uh, good catching. Uh, good route running. A uh, solid route running. If you upgrade, if you get play fake and uh, max out uh, play fake on this card, he'll have 90. I think 90, 91 short, 92 mid. So it'll be a good. It'll be good uh, on that. Otherwise, he's he's still a solid card. He's not anything special. Um, and then the next card that was showcased with that was Malcolm Butler. Um. Yeah, I I don't like this card for obvious reasons. Um, I'm just gonna let you guys figure that out. No, but I'm just kidding. He, he, to, be, to put my pettiness aside, he actually is a good card. This is one of the better corners uh, in the. This is one of the better cards in the promo actually. Um, 
good overall speed, good uh, coverage stats, good press, good a uh, little bit on the lower side of play rec, but overall he's still it's just still a good card. Um, yeah, you know nothing really for me to say. He's he's a solid card. Um, so then we will move on. DeAndre Hopkins. He is one of the masters for this set. Um, this card is. Wow, this card is a really great card. 94 speed, 99 jumping, uh, 95 catch, 97 catch in traffic, 96 spec catch. Uh, overall, so, uh, a little bit lower route running than I thought, but hey, this is still a really good card. Um, powered up and with Sprinter maxed out on the on a Cardinals or Texans theme team, he's going to have 99 speed. Um, he'll have a good, I think he'll have a 98 catch in traffic. And a 97 spec and a 90, yeah, 96, 98, 97, um, and 90, uh, 98, 97, and 96 catching stats. This card is just really good. Uh, he's one of the masters and he, he he's just, he's a very good receiver. Um, so there was more that was introduced, um, for, okay, now I'm in Ultimate Legends that I will talk about here in a minute. Um, but yeah, DeAndre Hopkins, really good card. Uh, the LTD, I'm not going to spoil all of them, all the cards that were revealed. Uh, if you do want to see them, go check out other channels because I am not uh, going to showcase them all because this video will be way too long. Um, but Darius Slade Jr. was the LTD card that they said that was promised. Um, this card is actually... You know, a lot of people were thinking that this card was going to be Devontae Adams, uh, myself included. I thought Devontae Adams was going to get an upgrade because a lot of people thought he was going to get Team of the Year, and he did not. So, uh, Darius Slay Jr., honestly, this card's a really good card. 97 speed, 96 acceleration, 94 agility, 93 jumping, 93 uh, play rec, 98 zone, 93 man, and 96 press. So, powered up. Uh, even powered up without lockdown chem, you're gonna get um, 99 zone coverage and 98 speed. This card, this corner, this card might be the best corner in the game right now. Um, and also, you can't really see it. I'll move this real quick. He's in actually a 98 overall. So with his power up, he actually will be a gold 99, which he'll be the second gold 99 in the game. I think he is the second. Because I know Jamal Adams gets gold 99 at sub-linebacker, but that's not really a position. That's just a specialist. But in terms of, like, positions, he might be the first... He's the first gold 99 defensive player. I know that. But he might be the second gold 99 player in the whole game with Powered Up. So, really good card. Really good card. Um, So, yeah, here is the other ones that were released today. Um... Uh, on Friday, I mean, yeah, I'm not gonna spend too much time on this on this, guys. If you do want to see it, um, check out Madden's Twitter. But other than that, I'm not gonna showcase all of them because, again, we're I don't want to spend too much time on the video. Um, and then moving on, the Ultimate Legends drop was revealed yesterday. So the first card is going to be John Randall. Now John Randall is getting his upgrade tomorrow. Thank goodness for that. Um, so I can definitely use him um tomorrow and uh get definitely get his upgrade and have him be my new starting uh d tackle tomorrow this is a good card um moving on like to his stats 83 speed which is a little bit on the lower side not gonna lie but he's a d tackle 94 acceleration 93 strength 97 tackle 96 play wreck and block shed 98 finesse and 94 power move this card is absolutely phenomenal. He also will become a gold 99 when um, you put him into the power-up. Um, yeah, nothing really to complain about here. Um, I'm going to be really happy when I get this card because then I will actually have a gold 99 on my team. <laughs> uh, this card looks really good. It's really good. I'm looking forward to picking this card up. Uh, to, uh, hopefully hopefully I'll get it soon. I doubt it'll probably be, it'll probably will be like in like a couple of weeks or something. I don't know. But he, rest assured that he is like top priority. He will be one of the first cards I go after. Uh, and then the next card that is actually also on my team. But has moving down in the depth chart is Jonathan Ogden. He is getting his Ultimate Legends card tomorrow. And he too will be a gold 99 overall. Um, card's really great. Um, as you see, 
98 strength, 98 awareness, 98 pass block, 97 pass block power, 97 pass block finesse, uh, 97 run block, 96 run block power, and 95 run block finesse. So powered up, he'll have 98, 99 strength, awareness, and pass blocking ability, which is nice. Um, and yeah, this card is just a fantastic card overall. Nothing really to um, nitpick here. He's, he's going to be a good protector, um, a, uh, edge protector. Um, however, I probably won't get him right away. I'll probably wait a little bit uh, because I do want to get uh, John Randall. Uh, and then after John Randall, then I might go after Jonathan Ogden, actually, because now that I think about it, after John Randall, I don't really, really necessarily need another upgrade. It, yeah, now that I think about it, I don't necessarily need another upgrade after John Randall. Um, so I probably could go for Jonathan Ogden because it might be cheaper to get him rather than get um, uh, Trent Brown. Uh, and I actually did pick up Dwayne Brown's upgrade recently, so I'll show you, case you guys that when I come out with my next theme team update. But yeah, this card is actually a really good card. Uh, and then the LTD for the Ultimate Legends promo is going to be Ricky Jackson, who is also going to be a Golden 99. So that seems to be a theme nowadays with with these coming upcoming releases. Is now these cards are going to start to become Gold 99s powered up, and, and then probably might see some just flat out Gold 99s here in about a month or so. Um, yeah, but this card is. My goodness, looking at the stats, this is a really good card. 92 speed, 94 acceleration, 90 strength, 96 tackle, 95 block, 95 play rack, 98 block shed, 97 power, and 94 finesse move. So powered up, you're getting to get 99 block shed, 93 speed. So with Sprinter and Saints theme team cam, I, I don't know if he played for any other teams, but with theme team cam, he'll get 97 speed. Holy balls. Um... That's insane. <laughs> that is pretty insane for an edge rusher. Um, and then he's going to have like 99 tackling um, and stuff like that. Yeah, this card is probably... This card's uh, this card is amazing. Whoa. Like, I did not look at the stats until now. All I did was just see that his card, uh, his upgrade. To be completely honest, I might pick this up. I'm not going to lie to pick this up for like an edge rush. Um, now his coverage may not be the greatest, um, to be completely honest, and I'm kind of expecting that, but this card, even as a, um, just a edge rusher linebacker, like, I might just put him as an edge rusher in my specialist and just go kind of ham that way. But anyways, that is going to be wrapping up all of the content in Madden and NFL 21. Uh, like I said, with the, um, the, uh, Mutt Heroes promo, uh, if you do want to see more of the mud heroes go to madden twitters because madden's twitter because i am not going to go through every single card because there is a lot um also there is going to be the the mud heroes promo is going to be throughout the entire month of march uh so every content update i will make sure to do a a um what's it called a um i'll make sure to include the mud heroes um but yeah that being said guys i hope you guys did enjoy Slap the like button if you guys did. And with that, I'll see you in the next one. I'm out. Peace.